Hello, Helen. Hello, Samantha. Hello, Sandra. Samantha, say hi. Oh, well, come on in. <laughs> Kit and Samantha are partners for their um, science project. <laughs> their teacher, Miss Sprouse, is a real bee for this one. <laughs> Kit, say hello. Samantha, don't be rude. I made some snacks for you girls. <laughs> Sandra thinks she's so sly. Let me tell you, I saw Hillary Rodham Clinton once. I'll tell you about sly. <laughs> oh, Samantha is very allergic to pretzel sticks. Here. There you go, honey. Well, Helen, <laughs> Feel free to come back in an hour. Oh no, I'll stay. Um, but don't you have something else that's in need of your presence? Uh, the only thing in need of my presence is my daughter. No shit, Helen. <laughs> I could say the same thing about Kit. And I do say the same thing about Kit. <laughs> Samantha, I'll be in the other room if you need me. <sighs> Sandra, could you get me a cup of milk? I'm parched. <laughs> Sandra, can you get me a cup of milk? I'm parched. Ask for a cup of milk in my house. You want a cup of milk in my home? Okay, fine. You can have a cup of milk in my home. I should have known that you would want to stir shit up. I'll show you stirred shit. I'll show you stirred shit. <laughs> so, Helen, um, Kit tells me that Samantha had to go to Mr. Cloak's office last week for pretending to be a prairie dog during the history exam. Is everything okay at home? <laughs> that must have been some sort of miscommunication. Mm, it's kind of hard to mix up a prairie dog, Helen. Perhaps the interpretation of the events uh, was a bit biased. Mm, is that so? Mm, yeah, Caper Adams, the boy who tattled on Samantha, has a huge uh, vendetta against her. So. Oh, Caper, sweet, 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 sweet boy. <laughs> he and Kit are quite close. Yeah, of course they are. I myself find him quite annoying, a bit like a loose zipper. Oh, sure you do. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. Oh, hi, Mr. Welsh, how are you? Oh no, you don't say. Oh my God, Samantha, are you sure? Samantha, you won child of the year for harvesting yams oh. last summer. Oh, thank you so much, Mr. Rigged. Welsh, thank you. Rigged. What? I, I'm sorry, what do you mean by that? Um, we all know that you and Mr. Welsh planted those yams in the dead of night with nothing but mood rings on two summers ago. How dare you accuse me of such a thing? Let me make something perfectly clear, okay? Mr. Welsh and I have never and will never plant yams together. Is that on the record? I'm a stupid woman. Samantha, it's time to leave. Oh, okay, well, Kit will handle the rest of the project and I will notify Miss Frouse that Samantha had to drop out. No, not before I notify Miss Frouse that Kit was stabbing Samantha with a rogue needle. Oh, Kit, put that down. Watch it. <sighs> Say bye, Samantha. Say bye, Kit. Oh, and look at that. That's mostly your handwriting, Samantha. Good job holding the weight, baby. Oh, please, that's Kit's handwriting. Samantha. Would you look at that? That really is mostly Samantha's handwriting. Hmm, great. Good thing I'm quick on my feet. You really need to step it up, Kit. I can't keep covering for you every day. Yes, we have a very busy afternoon. We're off to point ballet class and intermediate paper mache. <laughs> intermediate? Thank you.